It's because you can take negative feedback and you can deal with the most stressful situations. So what happens is it changes, it optimizes your brain to dealing with things like performances, like meeting one of your music idols, Amanda Palmer. It's like a little secret and she's out. every time I go on stage, I go to the bathroom first for two minutes, no one knows where I'm going, and I just stare in the mirror and go. <laughs> So that's, that's what happened, and we published this paper, and it, you know, we were not prepared for the media sort of crazy craziness, and, and uh, we were motivated to keep doing this work, and it turned out, you know, I, so I was asked to give this TED talk, and I had no idea that it would, it would go crazy viral, and thousands and thousands of people sent me emails from about 80 countries, uh, and men and women, all you know, powerless, powerful, telling me how they had used it to change their lives or to change somebody else's life. And and one of the ones I showed today was a woman who's completely physically disabled, who imagines herself standing like Wonder Woman, and it makes her feel so powerful and in command of the room. And I, it's just as a social scientist, there's nothing more than you could hope for than to see your work have that kind of impact. So it's it's been a crazy, amazing experience, and for me, TED is not about the people who pay, pay $10,000 to come, although th th there are many things they can do to help people kickstart important campaigns, but it's really about the millions of people who are exposed to ideas that they would not have been exposed to, or sciences that they didn't know existed, and uh, and, and that's what's happened, so I, I'm just, I'm thrilled, I'm, it's been an incredible gift to hear from these people. I. I want to adopt all, you know, 4,000 of them, <laughs> really. But I think we should practice some power poses. Yeah. Do you want to use some power poses? Yeah. Or just you and me? Uh, well, we'll start with you and me. And since uh, I can't take pictures of myself, somebody better take pictures of me posing with Amanda Palmer. <laughs> all right. What are we doing? All right, so we're going to do some really simple ones first, but they're really easy. It's about expanding. Uh, being open and occupying space, all right? So here's the first one, it's really simple, and I just call it the starfish. So let's just do the starfish. <laughs> For like two minutes. Everybody two do the starfish. Starfish. We, we need a four. Four seconds, four seconds, that's what I meant. <laughs> Can someone take a picture? Can someone take a picture of all these people power posing? Here's another one, I told you this already. Wonder Woman? Wonder Woman. Just, you know, 30 seconds. Before you go into a job interview, 30 seconds in a bathroom stall. Or in an elevator, do that. You know, not when you go in, because honestly, if you go in like this... There's a whole musical element missing, which is you need to also be imagining the theme from Rocky. Yeah, I know. Totally. Totally. <laughs> And it will optimize your brain to deal well in these really stressful situations. Okay, can I, can I start? It reminds me, well, not reminds me, to me it's basically the same thing as yoga. Yes. Because yoga is a much more committed practice. So there, does anyone here do yoga? Yes. So my, my life has been transformed by yoga. Mostly, you know, you practice it, you practice it. Not, things don't always transform completely, but sometimes they do, and it's very physical. Like, you do this with your body, and you find yourself crying and thinking about your parents or your relationship, and all of a sudden, your little fetal ball on the floor, yes. uh, it's very real. Yeah, so I think yoga, actually, about 80% of yoga poses are power poses, uh, and the 20% that are not, are not low power poses, they're very comforting poses. So, uh, I, I think that's fine. Can we do a hugging pose at yeah. some point? Of ourselves? Or each other? Of each other, of course. <laughs> but not yet. Alright, we will definitely do I'm handing somebody a, a camera to take a picture because I can't believe this. <laughs> somebody, somebody said to me, because I said, Don't steal any of this there are people, there are people in, in airports that come up to me and they go, this is what they say, they go, are you? Last, last week, and I was in one of those like bike rickshaws, and I was like, it's the middle of the night, and some guy, some guy goes, TikTok girl! <laughs> I'm 
so sorry. It's really funny, I know. Uh, it's, I've had people come up to me, it's happened in New York a few times, and people are like, you're that chick, I see your eyebrows, you did the art of begging. <laughs> and you just sat here. <laughs> Yeah, I'm it's, it's, very happy to be known for my TED talk and not for my artistic output. That's, <laughs> that's the amazing thing about it, is, is bringing people together in that way. Right? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'll get there. I'll turn it around. Do you wanna, let's do, let's do a fucking really all right. something large. All right. Let's get the, the, hold on, I need, just need this in the photo. <laughs> It's important. You don't know why, but maybe. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this is like submissive chair, powerful chair. No, totally no, you don't understand. Oh, God! Don't make it here. Political. 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 Political.